Philly 5 at 730. And that does it for the news here at 10 o'clock. Next on the KTLA 5 News at 11, protests erupting in downtown Sacramento as thousands are calling for justice in the police shooting death of Stefan Clark. And police investigating a deadly plane crash here locally in Ventura County. That's all next on the News at 11. Now at 11, President Trump in a war of words tonight with California. The latest tweets targeting Governor Jerry Brown. Plus, a plane crash in Ventura County turns deadly. What investigators are saying about the home-built aircraft. And protests continuing tonight to erupt in Sacramento as crowds call for justice in the police shooting death of Stefan Clark. Now on the news at 11. How are they protecting us? Now at 11, breaking news in the wake of a police shooting up in Sacramento. A big crowd there told to disperse or face arrest tonight. Hello, everybody. I'm Rick Chamber. And I'm Courtney Friel. Reports from the scene say one protester was hit by an ambulance. And tonight's rally is just the latest, of course, in response to the shooting of Stefan Clark a few weeks ago. We want to take you to a live picture up in Sacramento where you can see protesters there facing off with police in riot gear. This has been going on for some time. The young man, 22-year-old black man, unarmed, was shot back on March 18th. Officers firing 20 shots at the young man as he was hopping fences into his grandmother's backyard. That's where he died eventually. Our own John Fanolio is in the newsroom now with new video and new information on the case. John. Well, Court and Rick, as you just pointed out, hundreds of protesters are taking to the streets in downtown Sacramento for the fifth consecutive night following that police shooting of Stefan Clark. Take a look.